Hi guys, Glader here. So today I'm making a video that I've been wanting to make for a little while now, and that is that this tool that I've been using for the spiral videos the past few days is going to be released publicly, and it's going to contain a feature that I don't believe any other tool is contained, and that is to solve what I call the protect color blending issue, and that is where you have these drastic color changes which are most noticeable if you only show the vertex colors. Oops, wrong one. Yeah, you can see there's some seams here, and it doesn't look very good. Some seams in other places as well. And so what I've done is I've written a, a clever blending tool or feature that basically looks at nearby meshes and tries to blend the vertexes that they share, the vertices are shared, and it takes a few extra seconds, but it's rather efficient. Oh, can't do that while running the game mode. Uh, <laughs> so it only takes a few extra seconds, and it's done rather efficiently. We only check nearby meshes. If we checked every mesh, it would take quite a while, but Thankfully, the result that I was able to write doesn't have to do that, and so that I don't think any tool does this. I know there's a there's a vertex color tool that allows you to bring in meshes to 3ds Max and export them with vertex colors, but I don't believe they do any vertex blending either, which is what I which is how it would, which is the only way to get it to look like it did Spyro, and so I think for the first time this is a new feature. Um, I'm pretty satisfied with it. Let's turn the textures back on. And we'll go into game view. And yeah, so the result is pretty close to Spyro. There still are issues with texture seams, UV seams, and Boy, that's going to be a hard one to fix, but if I fix that, I, I'm pretty sure that'll be a huge deal for a lot of people who want to bring stuff in like this into Unity. Not even use any modeling software, just use a little tool, click a few buttons, and then boom, you know, it's working. So that's the announcement today. I'm really happy with this. I am quite surprised that I was able to do this, um, and I don't think it's been done before, although at least publicly, although I could be wrong. Um, Thanks for watching, guys. I'm going to try to get this out today or tomorrow, so maybe we'll see another video once it's published. Thanks for watching.